strange glitch that it is. I do it and now it's working. <laughs> Let's just go before the stream dies. Right, stream is good. Right, okay. So it should get me popping up any moment now. Hopefully. If it doesn't die, which it hasn't at the moment. Oh, there we go. Me popping up. Uh, okay, cool. Sweet. That's been tweeted out. So, good evening, everyone. My name's F1. And welcome to another race about round six, not nine, as I just put on Twitter. Really badly uh, mucked that up there, but it was a long day. Um, but welcome to round six of, of the Stanley and the Jenkins Cup. We are at Monaco this round, so it should be very interesting to see uh, what strategies have been placed. Because Monaco is a very tight circuit to be able to overtake. But being as always, we have got Liam Jenkins. Good evening, Liam. Good evening. How have you been today? Been busy? I have. I was working earlier and then got home and ate a whole pepperoni pizza. Felt bad. So <laughs> went out on my bike and cycled three miles in 17 minutes and now I'm knackered. So I'm, I'm happy with that. I've made progress. I burnt a whole half a slice of pizza, I think. Oh, very nice. <laughs> Every little helps. Every little helps. Exactly. As you can tell, I'm still in my work gear. <laughs> As always on the Saturdays and sun uh, Fridays and Saturdays, always still on my lo work gear. Uh, I went for a little drink before or after work even. Had a bit of a chill, came home, and now I'm here. So it's all greatly uh, involved in. So good evening, Sebri, evening Anthony, evening Spets, evening Turkey, evening Anthony again. Hope it works. I found a little glitch that if I did, if I stream for about two or three seconds on Twitch, and then stream it on YouTube, it works. I have no idea how that works, but, you know, I will take that. Um, but, yeah, as we've uh, only officially just gone live now, uh, I will say something in result to what uh, Cook Racing happened yesterday, uh, Spanish Grand Prix. Uh, Cook Racing is Anthony's team. I have sent him a message and he has uh, agreed with the message. And I, me and Liam were discussing it, what would be a fair penalty. Uh, for not making a pit stop. So first off, he will get a warning. You're only allowed to get up two warnings in the league if you don't make a pit stop. Um, so he first off gets a warning. The next result, he his points that he scored that race. I think he believed he got second and ninth place. Um, he will his points will be removed. Oh, it's not Anthony's team. Sorry. Oh, Ollie's team. Sorry. Sorry, Anthony. It's Ollie's team. Um, his points will be uh, removed. So anyone, so his points will be removed. So he'll be removed from the result. I will keep a separate Excel table to keep track of that championship. But the guys in 11th, everyone who were behind him will move up a position. So you may not get it on record, but I will be uh, keeping it in touch. Um, on the championship, so everyone who, so whoever was in 11th and 12th will move up uh, relevant positions. So, and you know, Liam, we said we said on Twitter la last night about it, and I'm thinking that you know that's the fairest penalty, as it were. I think that yeah, by all means, that's the fairest way. I mean, I think that if it went unpunished, and although you know, fair play to me, did come out and say, look, he gave a valid reason why, which is acceptable. But rules are rules, and if you let one slide. You don't know that four or five other drivers throughout the coming weeks are going to go, okay, he got away with it, so can I. And if that's the case, or for instance, that those uh, seven points that he gained dictate the course of the championship, then when it gets to the end of the season, and if that's the difference between who gets in the Jenkins Cup and who stays in the Stanley Cup, it's going to cause quite a bit of riot. So I think that's the fairest way to do it. Whilst it still keeps to the rules, he's still able to compete in the league, and then that way he learns not to do it again. And also, you don't, you don't, miss out a race like he did say to me he said he would let he would um he was just waiting for the decision he was saying he would miss uh, the monaco Grand Prix, uh, the monaco race um to actually let other people um be able to catch up um so yeah so thank and uh, um, thank you Ollie as well for um accepting the warning and the uh, unfortunate points being removed from is it but you know we did we do say and you, it, it it could be just some miscalculations but you know, it's that—that's the rules, really. We do say you have to pay at least once. Um, but yeah, 
so thank you already for completing that. So um, with that, guys, also, if anyone is able to print screen the results for me uh, for each race, and then I'll be able to do the Excel table. So I have asked Tim uh, Fami Racing to be able to do that. So uh, if anyone is able to do that for me, that would be very appreciated. Um, through Twitter, through the Facebook group, uh, be able to send it to me because I can't access it. So um, I need to try and see what is happening. And Dom is saying, why can't I comment on the stream? I'm not sure. I'm not sure why you can't come up on the stream, Dom. As we are hitting uh, 12 people in here. Um, right, let's have a look at this. So, in how Toka saying, yay, still got no no points. Um, he's going with option, option today. Anthony saying, I hope that I don't get a classic Jenkins. And the same with Spears. And Anthony says, I'm getting the Jenkins illness. What's a Jenkins illness? That's brand new to me. <laughs> well, I haven't heard of a Jenkins. You, you forget to be ill? I, <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, Spet Semcha has changed two degrees since practice, though. Anything eh, could happen. Um, even in Dream, also I saw you in there. Even in Dino, even in Keeper, uh, even in Tom. Your thoughts on Canada qualifying? Incredible result by Bottas. I would comment on qualifying, but I was at work, and I came in. Late. I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> yeah, so I have no idea. I know Bottas did well. Um, I'm so happy for him. Did he get third? I heard. Yeah. Right, okay. That's all I know. That's all I pretty much know about it. I know Bottas got third. I know Button didn't make it, uh, Button and Webb didn't make it across the line in Q2, um, which is kind of annoying. I kind of dropped my Tom, but, you know. Uh, even in Cyber, you're finally in. Um, Spears, race results or season standings? I want each race result. Um, I'm only going to take the points by the teams because that's what we're focusing on for promotion. So if you could do that for me... Uh, uh, Spears, if you can, that'd be really great help. Um, just so then I can just keep a track on the Excel. Um, I wouldn't do that otherwise, but you know, it's just that race. Uh, Vandergaard got pole. <laughs> I know he didn't get that. I think Vettel uh, got pole, I believe. But you know, I think Williams, hopefully, Williams can have a decent race though uh, tomorrow. I will be able to watch the race tomorrow as well, so that be that should be very interesting indeed. Um, right then. Oh, two new interactions. Also, you can watch other league races. Just put schedule. Yeah, you can go spectate. Work uh, spectate. Oh, wait a minute. Can I? Oh. Oh, okay. Thank you, Dom. All right, don't worry, uh, Spears. I've actually found a way to actually look at results on here. That's decent actually. I didn't know that Liam, you can actually press schedule and it comes up with all the races and the winners and the results. I wish we knew that at the start of the yeah. championship. <laughs> okay, that's very helpful. Okay, I don't need that. Thank you, uh thank you. Um uh Dream, hey Tom, you can see the results on other leads by going to rookie tabs on home and then clicking schedule. Yeah. I know that now. I didn't realise that. I did not realise that. I can do that now. Okay, I will I will sort out the Excel uh, table after this race. Um, so it should be interesting. And also, I've got to try and figure out how I'm going to do live streams in July as well. As I'm not actually at my main PC for that. So I need to try and figure out how to do that. Anyway, um, so we're waiting for the results to come in. They should be in very soon-ish, I reckon. Yeah, we'll just I'm wait. I'm still trying to find it on the server list, actually. Where it, is it? It does take a while, though. I think it'll be up by about quarter past. Um, but yeah, I would love to talk about the Formula One, but I have no idea of what happened, so I'm very sorry, guys. Um, but you know, um, but I can't believe we hit 30 people as well yesterday. We hit 30 people as a peak. Wow. Um, and that, and that when it hit that peak. It was when Liam was playing um, that mouse game. <laughs> I think I might do a little trans for my stream after this, to be honest. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Judging my life. It's just something fun. I never expected people to actually join. I was just kind of hoping for me to be sat there on my own, bit of all by myself, playing in the background, me, little mouse jumping around. And we had like 10 of us in there in the end. It was great fun. <sighs> I was very surprised that people were staying around, watching. <laughs> You know, watching or even joining in with you, like you said. So that was uh, pretty amazing. 
Um, in it, in it, in it. Results are in. Oh, results are in for qualifying. And they are. Okay, uh, so let's have a look at the Marco Grand Prix. Ooh, ooh interesting. Uh, very interesting. We also have a new team as well joined into the league because there was a one spot available. Um, and that is Lamy GP. Ooh. Um, so have you got the results up, Liam? I have. Da, 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 da. Well, those are people who got the 2D pack as well, I've got to say. Four, three teams? Oh, yeah, three teams. Oh, I know what I've done. I've clicked what the league done? and not the race. Classic. Hey! <laughs> Come on, IGP. With a bit of luck, I won't have to type the password again. <laughs> Probably will do. There we go. Time. There we go. Right, do you want to take us through qualifying then, Liam? I oh, will indeed. So, Luigi takes pole position again, so looking pretty strong there after... It was a good race for him, let's see what we can do here. Supernova second, so a good move there for Rydell. Aimlo Motorsports finishing third, so obviously aiming quite high. Uh, Tupikov for Supernova second and fourth, locking out the two front rows. Good job there. Luigi's other car in P5 in front of the first of the Frammy cars in P6. Aimlo in seventh in front of Cook in eighth. Dino in ninth and the other Frammy in tenth position. Cook in eleventh place in front of the first Fast and Furious. Massive jump there, actually. Oh, wow, yeah. They were at the back of the field there, so well done, Tom, to that one. Cal GP in 13th, Boss Racing 14th, Seb Racing uh, 15th in front of SWS in 16th, Boss again just behind his teammate in Boss, 17th not really position. Go, got, not got really qualifying for Boss today. He's normally up there, ain't he? Oh, so I've noticed that about qualifying as well with the other drivers. I'll touch on that in a second. Um, CCH 18th, Fast and Furious 19th again. So both drivers inside the top 20, so that's progress. Mm. Uh, Team Turkey inside the top 20 as well. Cal GP just outside with Sebs racing alongside him. Chaz racing 23rd in front of the other Team Turkey. SWS and CCH round out your top 26. Lamy GP, Dino, Chaz racing in your top 29. 30th is Zafro in front of Lamy and Alex's other car in 32nd but regarding the top well top 10 really there's what so there's both luigi's both of aimlo's both frammies and both supernovas yeah so four cars well, four so teams really us so eight of the ten are compromised of both drivers from four teams that's really consistent by the guys at the front i think this championship's really getting closer now especially i mean We've seen a couple of unpredictable results, especially like when you look at the standings and everything. It's not that far away. I mean, what, I think Supernova 24 points behind Name Low at the moment? Um, I think it's something like that. So for them to be starting second and fourth, then in front of one, in front of both drivers there for Rydell, actually. So this could be a kind of turnaround point for them. Yeah, uh, championship standings at the moment for the Stanley Cup is Aimlo with 124 points, Supernova with 100, Luigi with 86, Boss with 60, Frammy with 55, CCH Racing uh, 32 points, and you got Cook. Well, Cook Racing's point. Well, most these points doesn't stand. These ain't official points because of what happened last race. Yeah. So I need to try and get the results sorted out. Uh, after this race, so uh, when the next week, I will be able to update you with the official points. But as it sounds unofficially, um, it's pretty close at the top. Um, so, but some people may get a bit more points, and some people may get less. So, it'll be interesting to see. But um, as we have got, also Scott is in, even in Scott, even in goalkeeper, and Dino, your awkward moment when Abe is in both leads. You got Abe in twenty-third, Liam. Eh? Twin brother. What? what? <laughs> uh, that must be a name change, surely. Hang on, right. One's called Kaisuke, eh? What's my guy called? Let's have a look. I don't even know what his first name is. That's really bad. Nice. Uh, where is he? No, Kane. They're brothers. The two Japanese samurai. <laughs> We've got apes in either league now. That's what we like to see. That's what we like. I want him to do me proud today. He's 23rd, so carry on the classic Jenkins sort of <laughs> performance there. So, yeah, first one in the name. Yeah, definitely. Uh, didn't I send Abe's twin brother is racing? Oh, yes. Oh, <laughs> interesting. So, people are going with hard tyres when it's a, it's a low tyre wear. Interesting. Very interesting. I'll say, this is the one race I would risk a soft soft. Yeah, soft soft would probably work very nicely in this one. As uh, good evening, Dre. 
Uh, good evening, Dre. He is in the stream, as that will just work nicely. I might just shrink my head a bit. Just so I've got a bit of a gap. There we go. That fits nicely. Very snug. Uh, I suppose I if tyre wear's low, we've seen in the past where, I mean, it doesn't play that much of a factor. And if you can hold them on long enough, you can run maybe 9 to 10 laps. But there's only, take a look at it, all of the top 10 are on soft. You can't do no suppers, guys. That's it. The rule is you can't do a no supper. And I think so. We did. We did try this in the first season. I believe that we did. Someone tried a no supper, but because of the amount of fuel that had, the, the soft tyres just quickly just went away. So by the time they came out of their pit stop, there they were pretty much ahead, and you had no chance and chance to actually catch up with the a pretty worn set of hards. But like I said. Everyone must make at least one pit stop as I see three, four, five cars on hard tyres. Wow. Um, but it'd be, you know, it'd be interesting to see what the hard does. But, like, logic and past experience of this, people normally go with a soft, soft tier because you can get away with it and you can just, you know, take it, take it easy with this. Um, but, yeah, evening, Dre. I hope your um, live stream went well as well for your qualifying. I would I would join in, but I was at work, sadly. sadly. As the revs are starting to build up, I've got to turn this down slightly. Revs are starting to build up for round six of the Jenkins, not Jenkins, the Stanley Cup. Will we see Ali, uh, a Ali take a win for Luigi again, or will we see CCH Racing take his second win on the trot? Who knows? We're about to find out now, as we are gone racing here in the streets of Monte Carlo. Into the first corner we go. A Ali is still in the lead. Uh, we have got the supernova. Oh no, you've got the supernova car still in second. Aim line third. Then you've got Luigi again uh, in fourth place, followed by the other supernova car. Then Frammy racing up to uh, sixth place here. Dom, shush. <laughs> uh, Rodney, Tom, are you having a better day today? Not really. I still had a terrible day at work. Thank God the stream's actually working today, so I'm very happy with that. As uh, we've just seen a move go ahead for Supernova moving up to 5th place, taken away from Bont in Frammy Racing. Pretty close though at the moment, Cook Racing there um, from the latest uh, scandal, the pit scandal as it happened yet last, yes, uh, yesterday's race, is currently in 8th and 11th place. So really well done, he wants to get those points back. Looking pretty close as well as so I come out the tunnel, I mean I was expecting to be quite a big gap almost in and all you've seen in the past you have the top 10 then about 11th to 16th then the stragglers but it's been quite a close pack so far mm, it's very close between uh, 16th all the way down to 32nd so you know uh uh rapid do you does anyone know how to look at the shortlist uh, of drivers you marked i believe it's on your manager page i believe I need to double check as uh, Abe has just been overtook as A. Ali takes the first lap, leads into the first corner. Um, Supernova's just behind, followed by Aimlo, and then the other Luigi uh, car with the fellow Supernova. Then Frammy Racing is up to sit, followed by 7th uh, of the Aimlo car. Cook Racing ahead of Frammy Racing in 8th and 9th place. Then you've got Dino Racing in 10th place, changing his colour from white to purple. As two cars have came out the pits of Abe in Chaz Racing and Lamy GP, switched to another pair of hard tyres. Very odd. Well, I wonder if he's going to go on to the rest of the race, actually. Liam. Yeah. It's... I don't know. They're just pitted. There's no... Unless... They can't be have that much of an advantage, surely. I mean, I know hard tyres. I mean, take a look at the pace now, though. What are the leaders doing? They're at 132. But, yeah. Um, guys on hard are about... We're hard guys. The uh, first guy's 17. 144. What's it's the, not worth what's the it, set surely. time? 33.2. He's what? 1.5 seconds slower. But considering the other guys in that pace are roughly about the same time. So where is uh, 17th place? Oh, he's leading the train. <laughs> he's leading That's the train. The <laughs> That's the issue there. Oh, and I think he's just got past. Yeah. Soft just got past uh, Hain there. 
as uh, eight, and he crosses the line, but Rydell does the fastest lap, only by two hundredths of a second, 31.02, as the guys behind 31.34, 31.86, 31.81, and then you've got a 32.17, uh, but some of the guys, uh, tie, the tyres ain't looking that bad, considering though, even in Alex, uh, sorry you're late, don't worry mate, don't worry whatsoever. Um, but at the moment, times are still looking de pretty decent. Loads of people still doing personal best. Um, but that's the thing. Hards are going to be... It's going to be interesting to see what Abe and White in 31st and 32nd is going to be doing um, near the back of the pack. Just to see. But they're 30 seconds down the field. Pit stops normally take, what, 20 seconds, 25 seconds? Around that, yeah, I'd say so. So, you know, anything can ha like I said, anything can happen with these, uh, with IGP, anything can happen as, uh, Ali does the fastest mirror set to the 30.7, but you got Kadame and Rancia also doing the 30.7, not as quick as the leader of Luigi bursting through, he's got about a 2.2 second gap, uh, behind the supernova car. So let's see, it'd be interesting to see what time these guys are going to be pitting as also as uh the luigi luigi does the fastest lap 30.03 only 300 of a second faster though from rydell as drs is now active so we got to see some people hit it uh gonna be using a drs and trying to pass the people in front but like we've seen in previous rounds, um, some people can't really use DOS. They have to be at least three tenths behind or right behind them to be able to get an advantage on the DOS on that main stretch. As you've got Abe catching up with Wet here. So this would be interesting. He will have DRS coming into the straight. DRS is now open. Oh no, he hasn't got DRS. And someone else is in the pits also. Wilson just came out of the pits in, uh, from Chaz Racing. But I think his suspension's not gonna last that long, I reckon. And just look at the tire wear as well. They're not dropping off that quickly, which is, I mean, take a look at the leader, what Ali's doing at the front. I mean, those tires, if you take a look at someone like Kadam's doing, mm. even though the tires are looking a little bit more worn out, and yet he's still. Pumping he's not pushing it hard at all. He's barely used any curves. Also, his tyres ain't looking that bad. I think he's like three temps off of each sector. But is it is it better to use a bit of those tyres to be able to get out? Uh, tyre wears quite quickly, but not warming up. Um, guys, let me know in the comments as well or in the IGP chat. What are your tyre wears for the soft tyres at the moment? That'll be interesting, so we can get a bit of a result here as uh, Abe. Is still trying to get past of White in Lamy Racing here. Um, coming into the swimming pool chicane. As loads of cars are now using curves. I see a lot more teams using curves now. Great to see that. 80% uh, uh, Liam for the soft tyres. In five so laps. So what? I mean that's... Well it's... You need to get to around lap 8 or 9. I'd say you need to make it try and double stint. Well, I don't know. It depends because... You ideally would have a short or second stint. True. Twenty percent, five laps. That's four percent a lap. I'm judging it by. So if you get to about lap twelve, maybe you'll have about fifty percent left of the tire. You know, we could we could see something as uh, a Ali does the fastest first and second sector, but he's using a bit of curbs now from the front. Could um, it be an in-lap? I, I say it's too early. He's using curves to build up a gap, surely, I mean... I know, but he's, it's too early. We're on lap 5 out of 19. I can't see him pitting. I can probably no. see some of the cars pitting about lap 9, maybe even late as lap 12, I reckon. I think that's going to be the pit stop window. As he does the fastest lap at the race, 27-3-4. Wow. From Ayali there, compared to a 29-3 from Rydell in the supernova car as it looked like there's going to be a pass maybe from the other Luigi car he's got a curse but he's so close behind the aim low car um, he's just flashing curves at me and he has passed Ranta is now up to third place taking over aim low as Frammy using a bit of curves looks like we're 24 oh wow look at Ranta's song it's 24-1 first sector 
very good time there for the first sector. It's, it's pretty mega actually. There's even throughout the rest of the field, the hard tyres aren't really touching them. I mean, a 26 8 is what the fastest man on hard tyres do, which is Han. And he's eight tenths slower than the man in front of him in the first sector. Is that the fastest hards? As far as I'm aware, the they're all 27s through the rest of them. Fastest hards I see is a 34.3. Yeah. Or the, the personal best is a 34.39, which what, yeah, that is his personal best. So hards are not looking too good at the moment. He's what, good four seconds off the pace? As, oh my god, I have not noticed, but Luigi has gone first and second. Luigi oh, wow. seems to be used half of his curves passing the supernova car, as the other cars have not even had an answer. 25 9! 25 9 9 there from the second of the Luigi cars there. Really good Push lap in. there. He's trying, I mean, trying mm -hmm. to get a lead out just so he can get out in front in first and second. But it seems that Luigi's got to catch up to these uh, three cars at back. I think this is Lamy racing and also uh, Chaz and racing Abe. here. <laughs> <laughs> Abe's not doing well, Liam. Abe is not doing well. We've got a car in the pits. Oh, oh who's that? That, been? that was a soft tyre stop. Seb's racing. Changing to soft, soft tyres. Is it a bit too early, though? He's going to have to last oh, at least 12 out. laps, so his, la his size are going to be down to about 12, uh, about 50% by the end of that sin. Coming out in 25th position, just behind the SWS racing team there. What's Han doing? He's still quite a bit of... Well, I don't know, he's around 5 tenths though, he's getting a little bit of time. Hmm. Ayali does the fastest middle sector at 28.7, while his teammate does a 29.7, Rydell with a 30.2, with Kadem now with a 30 flat. So he's slowly catching up, and the A low driver is slowly catching up to the supernova car, as Luigi, I think in two or three lap time, is going to be lapping these three guys at the back, as he crosses the line does a 26.89, a second off the guy... Um, behind does a 28 flat. Not a personal best, but has he run his tyres out? Is it the same with Rydell? Had they run their tyres out a bit too much? Three more it cars still doing been. personal best times. I think Ali may have pushed too hard. He's losing a bit of time now, kind of. I think his tyres are degrading a bit faster. He's saying that, but he just doesn't personal yeah, best. He responded just as I said that. <laughs> And look, he's going, he's lapping cars. Never seen this. With curves as well, Never. but he's just not this early stage either. He's really using his curves, trying to get a d decent gap in front of the cars behind. Because you've got to say, behind Luigi's second car, as we've got, uh, I think this is Dino racing in the pit, switching to hard tyres. Um, it's not really a bit of a gap. They've still got quite a few cars here. Um still within what about a second so they've got DRS if they have got DRS active um, but Cadum is still doing personal best up the personal best in full place in the aim in the aim low car so can we see him maybe pushing as Campbell that's a 28 3 in the Frammy racing car slowly catching up to the other of B or boy in the aim low car as uh, we see the second of the Luigi cars starting to lap cars now um, coming on to the main stretch, he will have DRS, so it has a bit of an advantage to get away from uh, the Supernova car. So, it should be interesting indeed. We're on lap 9 out of 19 now at the Monaco Grand Prix for the Sandy Cup. Uh, this should be very interesting indeed. So, we're now approaching what should be the first proper round of stops then. Yeah. And into the pits is as from 13th. Both, both boss racing cars are in the pits now. Lap 9 of 19, refits for soft tyres. I can't blame him, the soft tyres are pretty much the only way to go here as he's exiting the pits now. Um, where is the current leader of Luigi? Uh, Luigi is still fun, uh, not, not doing personal best, but he's still doing decent times though. Um, he just got, just lapped Wilson in the, from 29th of Chaz Racing, um, who has pitted already, so he'll probably unlap himself. Um, so both boss racing are out. They are 19th and 20th respectively. Um, 
I don't see a no swap. Like I said, if anyone does a no swap, they will get a warning, and their point. And if they do end up in points, they will have points removed. So it will be very interesting to see what will happen. As the I thought, oh, we've got another car in. We got Alice in in 28th. Just been lapped as well by the Luigi car as we go on to lap 10 of 19 now. Catching up here of the Dino Racing car. Luigi now passing, uh, I believe, Chaz Racing also. So, making a few laps here. Five cars on the lap, one lap down already. As LEA does the fastest last set to a 32 1. So he's still flying. But both of his drivers have run out of cars. Well, Although, got, I mean, that's they got a little bit. Now. They got a little bit. There's a few more cars yeah. on the pits. Frammy's just pitted out for a brand new pair of soft tyres in ninth and tenth, so it guarantees him of him having some points in the end of the race. Jackson is is pitting now for soft tyres. Um, is it just me, or is this way more exciting than Jenkins Cup? Hey, hey, hey! hey <laughs> don't you dare, the Jenkins Cup. Uh, Alex has put in the comments, um, you guys should do a long a video along the lines of the basis of IGP so noobs like me can understand it a little bit more. We should do that Liam actually. Just make yeah. a little test account and maybe just run through. No, I wouldn't have a problem, like a little guide to IGP. Yeah. Yeah, I'll know. be up for that. I'll be up for that. I'll happily do that. And I'll probably try and share it all. Oh, a Ali in the pits. A Ali, the leader, is in the pits with Alex's other car also in the pits. But we got a pit for soft tyres. Yes, indeed, both of them. Both of the Luigi cars are in the pits for soft tyres. Rydell stay out there. No, Rydell's no, in. Well. Aim low is in. Supernova is in. Would the other aim low car? Out. Aim. All right, the top six are in the pits. So the top six will remain the same. Let's see if Cook Racing can do anything about it. Will he pit this lap? He does not. He carries on for another lap. So Luigi are still holding out in first and second place. Uh, Rydell just coming out of pits now. Supernova just in front of Cook Racing. But Aim Lower is behind the Cook Racing machine. So now you've got to wonder, I mean, the drivers who haven't stopped, are the tyres getting better or are they getting worse? I mean, mm. White last time round, still P12 already started, and he did do a personal best of a 129, and those tyres are slowly dipping away. You've got a driver that I think that's Rizanen for Team Turkey. Team Turkey did a one first one, yeah. And also Cow's other cars in the pits also. No fastest personal sector, and that is... White hasn't pitted in yet, neither is Muller. Where's Muller? Is Muller same team? Yeah, Muller's same team. Even fourth um, Cook Racing has not pitted uh, yet either. Well, Wilson hasn't in sixth. So we've got fourth, sixth, and then 12th, 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th have not pitted. Han has all, not also not pitted yet. So uh, it'll be interesting to see who else is in so we've got Seb, uh, Sebastian of CCH Racing in the pits we'll set to another soft pair of tyres uh, as we have got Luigi Lapin of Dino Racing's car ah okay Rain Dog this is Cook Racing he's on the old Mac mm. this will be interesting Okay, so we've got Dino racing in the pits from 8th place. Uh, also, we've got White in the pits, also from Fast and Furious. Um, so let's see where he ends out. He was... Oh, we've got, a, we've got someone out of fuel. Rizzano, that was from Team Turkey, wasn't it? Yeah, where is he on the track? Where is he on the track? Is he in the pits? He was around 16th, I think. Where is his other driver? Uh... I can't see him on the track, unless he's disappeared. His other driver's Hoffman in 19th. We've got, he stayed out another lap. Okay, so we've got the first of classic Jenkins of tonight's live stream, guys. Run out of fuel. Um, but yeah, Cook Racing is on the old max, so he may, may not pit. Hmm. Well, I'm hoping for... Uh, and Rain Dodds, it, he does pit. So Yuigi has just finished both cars of his of his curbs now. So he has no more curbs. He would just go on to the race.
on his pure engine power alone and shouldn't really get he should have no contention with that fastest lap either um okay cook racing is in the pits cook racing is in the pits will his second driver of Strat Strafer will be entering the pits he comes on for another lap as aim ahmad is still in the pits as it's in the pits now can he be remaining in the top 10 i believe he will so i see he will score points this race as pretty much the top 10 apart from uh, his teammate's driver has not pitted yet as we're gonna have someone else in the pits maybe no we do not it's all kind of set in stone for a bit now i think yeah currently the leaders is a alley in luigi f1 about to lap 24th position and then we have got Ransa in second place. Then we have got the Supernova car. As we've got Electronics Force of Anderson at the hairpin. Electronics Force takes him out of the race for Dino Racing. He retires for the second, well not the second race, but the second retirement now. And Anthony Chew said it's a classic Jenkins for him as well. So unless that's for Turkish GP. Well, no, no. I think that is, no, is that another Luigi. One? I believe. Is that Luigi's team? I believe it is. So would I have to pit again? I think it's the worst feeling when you get a classic Jenkins and you've got about... Six six, it's not the fact that you just run out. But when you've got about seven litres left and you have a right, I don't know, maybe two, three laps to go and you, know, you just don't have enough. Mm. And you just know you're not going to make it and it's just a sense of impending doom. <laughs> All right. Not a lot of cars doing personal best, Liam. The only one doing personal best was Strifer, but he's now in the pits. So he will drop down outside the points, I believe, as Dino Racing, the so remaining Dino Racing car, will carry on and take that point away from him. And also you've got SWS taking 11th place. So it's going to be a bit of a battle here for 10th place. I'm um, seeing some, oh, uh, some fresh new rubber for him to see what he can do. But currently leaders are lap 14 out of 19 is going to be a alley as a uh, abe liam is in the pits also um is he switching to soft tires is that his second pit stop it is white has not pitted yet but he, that is a classic jenkins two he, pit stops he <laughs> is on four more <laughs> <laughs> white is has not pitted yet but he's not on hard tires so we shall see how long he can go but you can tell white is not having a good day hard tires just does not work on monaco at all So, leader, 15 out 19, you have got A. Addy, followed by his teammate in second place. Then you've got Rydell for Supernova in third place. Aim low is still behind him. He will have DRS, though. Um, Supernova will not have DRS. So, there goes Cadian with DRS. He will slowly catch up with the Supernova car in third place. Supernova also in fifth place with Frammy racing in fifth place. Aim low in seventh. Frammy in eighth place then you have got cook racing in ninth place but wilson is slowly catching up but also you have got also uh i can't even pronounce that name i can't even i'm not even going to attempt it in 11th cook racing in 12th with a few little battle here for 13th 14th 15th and also 16th so nice little battle here for 12th shaping up um i'm about to lap someone i'm in 20th ready okay yeah, some of the bat markers are really pretty slow out there today. Um, how many cars have been lapped? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cars have been lapped this race. Hmm. So what do you think, Liam? What's going to happen? Will we see a classic Jenkins from... Um, who is it from? From Anthony here? It could be. It's... I don't want to jinx it, though. I don't want to say he wrote and then he does, or he does and then he won't, but... It all lands, uh, kind of lies in the hands of the gods now. I, think. Mm. I mean, Aiden again. Yeah, it just came um, out. First yeah. pit stop now for I was right. No. Nine litres left for... Uh, There's, I just... Luigi. If I was him, I'd just put everything on hold back as much as you can now. Yeah. He's got a decent lead. He's just, what? He's got a 1-2. He's 16 seconds. Or 8.2 seconds away from second to third. Even if, like, one driver retires and one stays, guaranteed a victory he's got like what an eight second gap to himself yeah Sebastian. he can afford to hold off 
definitely. Sebastian does the fastest first sector down in 24th. A 24-1. He's, he's just gone that lap down. And Wilson's retired. Wilson retired, has uh, retired. On the coming out of swimming pool chicane. So that's another one down. We're just waiting for eight now. But he needs to unlap himself, I believe, again. Uh, we've also got Han in the pits, also making his one and only stop, uh, switching to the soft tyres. But we're just waiting for White. And also, um, Jensen also, of SWS. He has not pitted yet. Hmm. SWS and also Lamy Racing. So none of those guys? Two, two guys have yet to pit. Oh, three guys even, actually. Both WS, SWS um, guys, both have not pitted. And also you've got White of Lamy GP. Guys, if you're in the live stream, as Abe is in again for his fourth stop. Um, I've said about four more. This is a true classic Jenkins, but this is like <laughs> when I first started with Abe. You have it happens. It's the curse of the Abe. The first race, and he makes about 12 stops. <laughs> and then I'll score a point, and then I'll do the same again. <laughs> But guys, you have to pit. If you have not pitted, you have to pit. If not, you'll be getting a warning. And if you do finish in the points, which at the moment you don't, you will be uh, losing those points. As Michelle is coming in the pits. Boss is in again. Again? Yeah, Boss is in again. So he may Where was that? That was from P... 11. 12? P11. 11. Is the set Boss again. Is Sit Seat coming in the pits? Wow. So both boss cars underfilling their car as we're on lap 17 out of 19. We've got three laps left. Guys, if you have not pitted... Oh, God, Tom, our strategies. What up? Oh, bugger, 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 sorry. <laughs> I, just, can... I didn't think this race would take that long. No, <laughs> I didn't think that race would take that long either, to be quite honest. Right, um, so there's roughly 2.5 a lap, I'd say. Um... I've done my fuel strategy already. I've just got to do the... How uh, many... Uh, uh, shh, I'm not saying anything. <laughs> that should be enough. It ain't enough. <laughs> I think that should be fine. That should be fine. Thank you, Liam, for reminding me. I was saying I should... I was going to attempt to not remind anyone. Oh, thanks. And then take all the glory and get a good result. But then I thought that would backfire. You get good results anyway now. I'm struggling. And I'd finish last and I'd feel awful. And everyone would take the mickey out of me. Abe <laughs> um, is in the pits again. Five pit stops now. It's like if this was William Hill, they're about to be like, able to make seven more pit stops before the <laughs> <end of> <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Abe. We love you, really. Um... As long as he doesn't do it to me, I don't mind. <laughs> right, how long have we got? We've got four minutes. Oh, that's a nice setup for Alternum. Not for me, <laughs> I'm struggling. Um, that should be fine. There's only one strategy that's going to work here, I think, isn't there? That's yeah, the soft, soft. Soft, soft. So it's wild. literally, this will be the one race about pace, I think. Yeah. And defence. Yeah. Okay, we have SWS teams have pitted. We're just waiting for White now to pit as we're on lap 19 out of 19. We're on to the final lap of the race now. Luigi seems to have got this in the bag as I'm trying to do one, one thing at the same time. But the weather is overcast at the moment. Now, that's the thing. And that's uh -oh. sweet. Okay, I am done for my setup. I've got the worst setup for Abe and the best setup for Ultimate. Hans has done a 23 8. Wow. In 6th place for the final first sector. Anthony, oh god, it is overcast. I don't like Anthony it. Anthony is not pitting. So, would he be able to make it to the finish line? He's coming through a swimming for chicane for the last time now for A. Ali. And his teammates just coming out the tunnel right now. Can Supernova be able to get a win here as Abe is in again for the fifth and final time, I believe, 
Alie coming through the final couple of chicanes coming in to the promoter corner here at Monaco as he comes through will we see him clonk out on the start finish line that will bring a tear to my eye it doesn't seem so he's gonna win the Monaco Grand Prix for the Sandy Cup there he goes he wins for Luigi F1 can we see his second car get a 1-2 for him yes we probably will there we go second place a 1-2 there for Luigi well done to him Supernova did well in third place coming across the line aim low slight disappoint probably for that in fourth place uh, again Supernova in fifth place and then you have got Frammy in sixth place really good result by him seventh place is a uh, Boyer in aim low then Frammy again in eighth place then we're just waiting for Dino in ninth place who did take 10th place away from Cook Racing. So we're just waiting for these guys now to come through. Dino Racing coming to the promoter at corner yes again. And we will so see him take two crucial points for the championship. Uh, as we see two points for Wilson and a point for Cook Racing. Really good result there for Cook Racing. Uh, Dominic White did not pit. I did see that but he could pit still this lap. I doubt it, but um, we we shall see indeed if he. D oh no, he has crossed the line. He did not pit. Okay, so White Lamy GP. I know he's only just joined. His other car did pit, so he should know the rules. So I will send him a message. And oh no, he is now pitting. Ah. Oh no, that's eight. Oh, that's a Michael. I was going to say that's, a, that's eight again. Yeah, seventh okay. time. I was right. going to say, that'd be kind of Michael Schumacher thing to do, wouldn't it, when he had to serve that um, drive-through <laughs> penalty? Yeah, so, guys, White did not finish, so I will be sending him a warning as well. I know it went for both cars, but it's still one of his cars, and it is for the team championship, so I will be sending him a warning. Um, no one gained anything from it, because he did finish two laps down. So he will be getting a warning for that and if it does happen again then he will be removed from the league so let's get back and see the results now um, of the Sandy Cup for that race uh, oh no that is Ron I don't want that I'm rookie schedule oh race will be posted in a sec I believe qualifying is taking place now it is qualifying is in place for the Monaco Grand Prix uh, Harrison what kind of fuel we're talking here it is going to be about two liters I put mine up to about 2.5 uh, liters a lap so you know you're looking for about that ways um, so let's have a look oh, at so I've got the fuel in oh, that's not good <laughs> oh, hang on no uh, I'm like I think 30 should be enough shouldn't it um, it should be okay. Depends how many laps you got to go on for though, that's the thing. That's all it matters. Yeah. I was going to go for 10. Oh. Okay, to... Right, waiting for qualifying now guys. It should be in at about 5-2, depending if we do get any errors or not, like we did yesterday. <laughs> Which should be pretty uh, interesting indeed. Um, let's have a look at the league. Ah, um, Rob's uh, brother cannot, he forgot to do a setup. Never know, could go well. <laughs> you never know with uh, anything like this. Right, I'm trying to get the race results up for the Stanley Cup so we can go through them. As, here we go, the race results are up. So, race results, and it is the race, I didn't put its quality now. So, race results for the Sandy Cup of Round 6. Alie takes his third win of the season in first place, followed by his teammate of Ranser in second place. A nice one 2 there finish from Luigi. Supernova takes the final podium position with Ardell in, in third place. Kadeem, Aimlo in fourth, Supernova in fifth, Rami in sixth place, Aimlo again in seventh, Rami in eighth, Dino in ninth, and Cook takes a one point there in 10th place. Outside the top 10, Cook Racing again in 11th place. Really strong comeback there. Seb's Racing in 12th. Fast and Furious in 13th. Boss Dan in 14th. Uh, 
with two stops, which is kind of uncharacteristic there for him. CCH Racing uh, gets fit deeps. SWS Racing in 60. Fires of Music in 17th. Team Tokyo 18th. Sebs 19th. Uh, Cow 20th. Boston 21st. Cow again in 22nd. SWS Racing 23rd with CCH Racing 24th. And it's with uh, 25th to 26th. Lamy 27th and 28th, but with no pit stop. So we'll have to send him a warning for that. Chaz uh, was the final remaining car in 29th. Uh, Wilson fell, uh, retired with suspension. A Anderson in Dino Electronics and Wilson in Team Turkey suffered with a fuel problem. Good evening, Rob. As we now wait for qualifying to go. Right, qualifying, Liam. What shall we happen? <sighs> I'm going to classic Jenkins it. I think I've got a bad feeling. Really? Yeah. As soon as the strategy locked, I had a bad feeling. And there's a 40% chance of rain as well. Oh, is there? Oh, that'd be interesting. Indeed. Uh, Rob, um, Luigi and Mario can share setups over two teams. Ready? Can you do that? I'm not sure. Has he got two, has he got two teams in the same league? I don't think I, has, I wasn't has, even awake. I have two teams. You can you can make two accounts, but yeah, he hasn't got two teams. I don't think it's only Luigi there. Unless he's joined another league and then just done that. I'm not sure. Right, was that to win, Liam? Okay, deep breath. Nice. Oh, well done, oh. Then. oh right. okay. Well, go for I the results then. Okay, so look at that. Wow. Completely that different, actually. That is a actually. massive result for Keep Racing. One, two. Very wow. nice. Great job. And I think was it Dom that said that it's either going to be Yoshi or Rob that wins? I can't see Yoshi or Rob in 2 position, so yeah, that's going to be... a ninth, actually. Let's come on, then. Wow. Now. Let's talk us through. So, Keep Racing, massive well done to them, the under-21s, to get a 1-2. In active creativity, we're very active in getting a third <laughs> position in front of Scott's first car of one of his Rosbergs in P4. He's got to be happy with that. Oh, I'll be delighted with that. Um, Beck is in fifth for Falcon. In front of, uh, just behind him is Tom. And then me, Abe, the samurai there in seventh. Good result, finally. In front of Rob, <laughs> something I never thought I'd ever say, ever. Um, ninth place is Yoshi's Island F1 in front of the other inactive creativity. Good so they're looking very good. Good top ten. Yeah. Uh, Tom just outside in 11th in front of the first Red Rock. Falcon 13th and Rob's other car, Rue, is in P14. Yoshi's down in 15th in front of Alton in 16th for my other teammate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 17th is Full Throttle in front of East End Racing. 19th is Rosberg. Wow. So a big difference there. So um, the only thing I can think of is either the setups were drastically different or the, the actual building of the cars, like the parts, some mm. of them were like really bad on one and really good on the other. So he's put all his focus onto repairing the bad ones, and then the other one's gone bad or something. I don't know. But, yeah, 19th there. 20th for East End Racing. 21st for LJA in front of Red Rock again. 4th for in 23rd for the Argentinian. Over Manly Men, 24th. Alex Stop Xbox in front of the other LJA, 26th. Adam to win. Round out the 14th row of the grid. Alex Stop Xbox again in 29th. Harrison, 30th and 31st. And over Manly Men, 32nd. Top 20 separated by second. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> That's mega close. Mega, mega, mega close. But it'd be interesting to see if anyone's gone with hard tyres. I don't, after watching that race, I don't think anyone should be on soft tyres. Um, like you see there, top 20 guys under a second with some guys like 1.2, 1.2, 1.3, 1.3. 3. So, you know, very close. I think it's going to be a very close field if everyone is on the same roughly strategy. Um, so yeah, I, I love these type of things. Uh, note to self, never open a stream in full stream, it will screw up the internet. <laughs> oh, don't do that, you'll see my face in high death. <laughs> uh, O'Keefe and Thompson are on hard tyres. Keefe is in 25th and Thompson is in 29th. Hmm. Interesting strategy there. Oh no, 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 that has gone horrifically wrong. Why? Uh, actually, you know, my power just literally just about enough. You're not seeing because I changed it as it hit 10-2 yes. to get 30 liters, but I'm stuck on 26 liters with both cars. 
if it's 0.3 laps, so roughly every three to, I don't know, every two to three laps, we'll get an extra liter gone. Mm. Um, so, uh, maybe Scott's just replied about your theory, Liam. Setups are the same, as are all my parts in both cars. Oh. Could be the health of drivers, uh, Scott. Could be the health of the drivers, because Hakim's eight, oh, actually, that, could not really do well because Hakim's leading my one with 82% health, Chloe with 92. So I'm not sure what happened there. You know what? Even if I do classic Jenkins this, I can hold my head high. I'm better than all of you at transfer mice. <laughs> that is gonna be the best quote of all these live streams. <laughs> <laughs> gotta be, gotta, gotta, gotta be. Right then. Um, loads of people are saying push hard which I will be doing, not that way. Um, but Alex says good luck to everyone. Thank you, Alex. Uh, Dominic, just as a demote Becker to driver two, he does well. Damn it, Becker, make up your mind. <laughs> um, but you never know. Anyone could have maybe some uh, problems along the way. So, you know, Harrison, you could make up some crucial positions here. But it's going to be close with the top 20. I'm going to see how close it is. You know, I bet there won't be any gap between the top 20. It should be fun. Um, lap 26 will probably get you to lap 10 considering what your fuel loads are um, you can't see my strategy because I've not really deceitfully put my camera over my strategy so I'm happy with that <laughs> here's hoping for a Belgian 1998 start <laughs> uh, Dominic, Liam remember you're in front of both Tom and me after the first race yeah. <laughs> this is emotional. This is I, I deserve an Oscar for this. <laughs> uh, rapid does does qualify and simulate traffic? I don't think so. Not that I know of. No, I think, I think it's a bit too. That'd be way too advanced. Yeah. Then you need to be able to see the qualifying session. Oh yeah, that'd be great. Um, as the engines start to roar, let's see who will win. Can not can keep racing be able to take his first win? We shall sound C as the lights are imaginary coming up onto the screen and we're about to go racing here for the Jenkins Cup of Round 6 as we are underway for the Jenkins Cup here in the world of Mo in the city streets of Monte Carlo. Very close already going to the first corner. Loads of moving. Hacking moving up to sixth place. Very good job. Passing Abe. Come on. And going up to now Becker in fifth place. Look how close it is going up to the hill. Coming through Casino, casino I believe. Um, and we're about to head to the Hepin for the very first time. As loads of cars have got cursed. So it'll just be very interesting to see. Um... Oh, look at all these overtakes. Rosberg up to third there for Scott. Very nice work there by Rosberg in, in the number 16 car. I we moved up to 13th and then I was down to 15th the next corner. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Rosberg's moving up. He's now into 20th um, in Scott's other car. But now there's, the field's starting to spread out a little bit now. Much, much more different compared to what we saw in the um, Stanley Cup. Hmm. It was like a massive cluster of cars, but now it's sort of spreading out a little bit, and I'm getting worried. I'm getting worried with Rob right behind me. No, I just need to catch you guys. That's all I'm concerned with, just <laughs> trying to stay with you. Where's the second car? You're in, what, 15th? Uh, yeah. He wants 13th, and he's now going to be 16th. Yep, he's down to 16th. Fisher, fastest middle set of the race, a 31 flat. Uh, the fastest lap we did have in the Stanley Cup was a 25? 9-9, nine nine, I believe? Something like that, yeah. So we're still seeing what the difference is for car-wise. So, uh, yeah, it's about 5% a lap, I remember. So uh, it'll be interesting. Scott is right on the back here of Odd of Keep Racing. But he's signed to get away as the fastest lap of 32-1 from the leader of Fisher for Keep Racing. IGP Norway under 21. That is on such a long team now. I'm just going to call it Keep Racing. Um, Scott is slightly closing up. Becker's closing up on uh, Inactive Creativity. Um, now you've got a little bit of a gap train starting to form behind Abe here, Liam, in 8th place. I'm noticing that and I don't want to push any harder because of the fuel. Becker, 25-5 for the middle sector. Or first sector, wow. I should say. Come on, Abe. I need DRS in curves now, please. That'll be helpful. 
as we go for the tunnel for the second time. Keep Racing comes out in first and second. Scott in second. Inactive in fifth. Becker it doesn't seem in fifth place. Me in seventh. Rob in seventh. Abe of Liam's team in uh, eighth place. Then you got Inactive again in ninth place. Then you have got uh, oh you got Loshi making the move now in tenth place. Just take over Chloe as Henderson is uh, keep racing a 30.7 there for lead there. Let's see, see what the pure pace is, is going to be for the leaders here. As Harrison is doing quite well, 27th and 28th in front of LJA, in front of over Manly Men and in front of Alex. A, a 30.7 there for the opening, or for the fast lap now, as Hacking does a 34.6. Not really that quick, but holding that well. But this is the crucial part now, guys. DRS is now open to be used oh, on God. the start threat. Like so this should be interesting to see as Yossi's really making a move now. I don't like the train behind Abe still. That's still scaring me. I don't like the train behind Chloe. That's the crucial. I know it's Hakim's been overtaken. Well, yeah, Rob's just overtook Hakim annoyingly, but points will be points. I'm happy with points I was say in the Jenkins Cup. And Dom is now saying, Rob, bugger off, please. It's still really tight up towards second place. Still doing the personal best for my cars though. I'm happy with the personal best. It'll be interesting now because quite a few cars now are within a second. So pretty much all the cars from probably second from third downwards will have DRS. So it should be very interesting on in that main stretch. Okay, Alex is not doing well but he's... Oh, both of his cars are on hard tyres. Okay. Yeah, don't worry, Dom. I've had that a lot with my ones. Oh, Abe! Is that, oh, Abe! Is he just passed someone? Or? No, he's on a 30.4. Oh, that's qu oh, wow. That's actually pretty quick. Across the line we go. Look at the DRS party. You're on the home stretch here. I doubt anyone will pass um, into the first corner we go. We may see Scott maybe having a go here. Oh, so very close. The pack is so close now. Scott is ever getting closer and closer and closer to the second car. Keep racing up Hendrickson. Um, 33 9 here for Rodriguez in ninth place behind you, Liam. So you got to look out for him. And also Yoshi, he's starting to make a move now. Uh, Alvarez of Robert, 24 8 in the first set. 29 7 for the fastest lap at the race there for Rob. Okay, come on. I'm just going to turn it off a bit now because I've been pushing quite hard. The tyres are going to start wearing out, and I know that I've got to have like another six laps on these things. Dre's going nicely. He is. All the, car, the cars are quite closely packed. Very closely packed. You know, the top, what is it, the top ten are separated by 5.7 seconds. Crazy. Is this anyone's top ten? Anyone can get a top ten. I mean, look, even Schwartz is there. Wow, like, 30.2 there for Red Rock. It could be any... It's all down the strategy now, guys. All down the strategy. I don't, don't use cars! Stop! You just oh, passed yeah. me! Oh, well, I have DRS. Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> an accident! I didn't mean to! Oh, no, I'm, I need cars on Rob! Rob, please! <laughs> Rob! No! Oh, yes! Oh. <laughs> just. I think I was barely oh, within a second. I'm battling here with uh, Rodriguez here. Okay, but right. Yeah. I just need to... Kind of stay in front now. Race. Now Fitzgibbon. Full throttle race here. 28.64. That's three different cars. Set personal best times there. Or the fastest sectors even. In the middle here. As now Hackings using a bit of curves. I don't really want that. I'll do it there. But I won't do it anymore. <laughs> it's so tempting. It's so tempting. Yeah, it is so tempting. I don't like being in control of it, but I know that I always waste it. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. So I can't win. Brooks, Come on, Abe. Other car in thirteenth place does the fastest first step to twenty-three eight. Wow. For Rob's other car, as my cars are still doing personal best, so I'm very happy with that. As I get James subscribing to the channel, thank you, James. Oh, Scott has managed to get into second place. Scott's in second place. Can he look for his first win ever on IGP? As now Rob is attacking Keep Racing's other car as he has now jumped to third place. 
Cheeky bit of curse, eh? Cheeky bit of curse. <laughs> How much percent have you got on your tyres? 76. I'm on exactly the same. This is going to be difficult. <laughs> Rob's now into go. third place, but he has not got no DRS. Keep race will slowly catch up, but will not pass him into the first corner as Scott is using his curves, but Fisher has not even used a single touch as Rosberg does a 27 flat on that lap there. Fastest lap of the race goes to Scott. I'm scared. This is too tense. Way too tense. Because everyone's matching each other's. I mean, look, we're quicker than the leader. And then Alvarez is quicker than the leader. And then everyone else is quite I can't cope, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a breakdown. It's just so much to... Look how close it's... When has it ever been that close for a top 10? To I stop? don't know. The top 10 are separated by 6.3 seconds. Man, this is close. And uh, oh. James, because Lamy GP was 29, does it matter that he didn't pit? It does. There's a set rule, like Liam said. If someone didn't pit and that's still outside the top 10, you're still getting the warning. No offence, but you're still getting the warning. We've got to keep a steady rule set set for everyone rather than just for one individual or if you're just in the top 10. Just general rule, guys. He did pit with his other car. He didn't with his... He did with one. He didn't with the other. So he's, uh, you know... Just got a um, set to a set set rule, as it's so close here from uh, from Becker downwards. So close. Uh, what are we? T what are our tyres? Uh, you could tell in the ch you could tell in the stream anyway. Rosberg's in the lead. Rosberg takes the lead away from Keith Racing. Rob is now starting to catch up with these guys now. Sky's in the lead of an IGP race. He must be jumping for joy right now. Oh, I can't cope. If I even if I was Scott, I would it wouldn't be able to react. There's just so much pressure to keep to racing, get the car to the pit lane. Keep racing now using a bit. <laughs> I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. What Dre just mentioned in the chat. But now keep racing using a bit of curves now, trying to catch up with Scott and trying to see how close he can become. We're going to see our first set of pit stops coming up very very soon. Um, Alex is saying something is wrong here. Alex, you're on hard tyres, mate. You're on hard tyres. You're the only two cars on hard, and you're just falling away from the pace. Keep racing. Use a bit of curbs. He's trying to be within that DRX zone to see if he can go ahead. 29.5 for Fisher now for the fastest middle sector of the race. Uh, I'm still doing decent times. I'm still doing personal best times. As uh, at the moment, oh, look at keep racing. So, so close now towards the back. But Rob is so close behind as well. I think Scott will just hold out into the first corner here. That curves, eh? Oh, DRS. Oh, that may just be my saving grace. So almost lost DRS. Oh. Oh, it's getting so close for the top three now. It's three different teams. You've got Scott. You've got a keep racer. And you have got Rob. Ban it out for the first place. We're going to see if he can get... See how long these tyres can last, actually, towards the end of the race. Still doing a personal best tyres. 27.61 was the last for Rosberg. A 28.2 and a 27.7. So Rob is starting to make a move here on the two leaders. As Rob is using a little bit more curves to see where he can go. As quite a few more cars now are using curves in the midst of the pack. Rob is going for it. Where's Rob? We need to zoom in on this. I think Rob has just overtook it. Yes, Rob has overtook Keep Racing. He's now so much making cares. a move. Is there really? I have no idea. Yes, there is. Everyone's using curves. I've got eight litres of fuel left. This isn't happening. I'm scared. I'm panicking. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm now down in ninth and tenth, but I'm good. I haven't used any of my curves. I say that and Hakim's using curves. Why? <laughs> Why? I bet. I'd rather be in control and waste it myself. <laughs> Oh, I'm right behind go you. Away, I can go away, Hacking, go away! Rodriguez, 28 sits in ninth place. As we're going for another lap of no one else is pitting right now. As we go into lap 9 out of 19. We're around about the halfway point as we've got the first car pitting now. I think this is Red Rock. Yes, Red Rock pitting from 13th place. First guy, let's see, he will change to another pair of brand new... Oh, no, he's got the hard tyres. Wow, we've got a hard tyres and also we've got LJA in also in the pits. Will we see him switch to a pair of soft tyres? We've got to see softs. Yes, indeed. We see a soft pair for LJA's car and also the other LJA team 
is also in the pits setting for a brand new pair of soft tyres. Rob is hunting down Rob is hunting down Scott like a boss right now as I think the second of uh, Keep Racing is now here as this overtook his teammate. Look how close it is though for fifth place downwards. It's crazy. I can't deal with it. You, you can't deal with it. I've got no drink. Neither do I. <laughs> Henderson, 25.95, fastest lap of the race at last lap in third place. Keep racing, has got pace still, but he's, un he's catching up with the guys in front. But this is going to be interesting to see what can happen as you've got Yostis uh, trying to pass uh, Chloe here for 10th place here. As we're going to see a few people in the pits. Keep racing, are in the pits. Keep racers are in the pits. Or oh, one of the cars are in the pits. Also, no, my DRS is gone. Who was that? We got inactive also oh. in. And we've it's got okay. a few it's cars okay. who have not got DRS. As Jossie's using curves. Jossie's using curves to try and pass Chloe into the first corner we go. It's going to be three to one. That isn't going to go well. As we've got a few people pitting now. And I think, let's see here. Yes, keep, keep, Yossi is still trying to pass Chloe, but there is no room coming up. And you said certainly come with more entertaining. Have that, Dom. Let's see what will happen here. Yossi's using a bit of curves. He has passed Chloe. Yossi's making a move now through the pack. As the top two are so, so close. And I can't keep up on to anything now. See, I was trying to risk it with fuel and put as least in as possible. I thought, no, because I'll mess it up and I can't oh, mess it up oh, in a race. Hello, Scott stay. is saying, no, wait, no. Michael's going to run what? out of fuel. Oh, my He's God. He's like, oh, no. We need to watch the leader. Is he going to run out of fuel? Can he get back to the pits this lap? As uh, both of my drivers are going to be pitting next lap also. And so Andre says, oh, Scotty. <laughs> you had one job, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Can we see Rosberg, Michael Rosberg, get back to the pits? One more corner to go, but he can stop in the pit lane. Out of fuel. Rosberg is in the pits. Rob is also in the pits. Keep Racing is also in the pits. Becker is in the pits. Will my, uh, Liam Pitt? Yes, he will. Top six are currently in the pits. Top seven. Top seven guys are all in the pits. It's a busy pit lane as uh, I think Abe's, uh, no, Liam's other car is also in the pits. And also both of Yossi's are in the pits also. As Dre says, Jamie Bugger to Scott. Rob is leading away, followed by Increated Motorsport in second. And then you got full four in third. As some as the guys are starting to rejoin back onto the track here now. Uh, hack him down in 15th place. Chloe coming into 17th. Will we jump Chloe? Chloe's in 17th position. Man, oh man, I need a drink right now. This has got a classic all over the shot. Got, but now yep. right, who's left to stop? All three leaders. We've got the three, uh, three leaders. We've got Hoffman <laughs> in fifth. You've got Rodriguez in ninth. You've got E. Palmer in tenth. And then you've got um, 14th right. place also has a pitted and Garcia in Adam to win. Adam to win? Really? In 18th 18 place? Not bad. I don't know the way Beck is chasing me down. Oh, Dre's got a worry about a Lacey. Okay. Let's go, hack him. Let's close up to oh, the front of the pack. Away. Okay, Rob is in. In creative activity are in the pits also. Oh, go, go, Abe. Come on. Come on. Massive. Jump them. Jump, Rob. I need Curz and DRS. I won't get... Any. Maybe. Rob's leaving. Go! 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 Rob's coming out the pits. It's go. going to be a busy pit lane coming out. Rob go. is behind Abe here. But Becker is right behind here. We'll so see what happens as Full Throttle is using their curbs in the pit lane. It doesn't work. Alacy's out of fuel apparently. And he is right. He is retired. He's the first retirement as he does the classic Jenkins in the Jenkins Cup. Congratulations, Dre. <laughs> <laughs> Top two have still yet to pit a full throttle and of East End racing. Currently leader with the pack, M Rosberg in a third position. Then you got the full uh keep racing in effectively third second place, then Rob's other car in third place. E Palmer has not 
pitted yet. Abe has jumped Becker. Also, that's actually a good point. Yeah, see, I, I played this so sly. So sly. You sly dog, you. <laughs> I don't know what's happened this season, but I'm a changed man. Somehow, yeah. You've been getting <laughs> points. Still a 90% chance of being cloudy at the moment. As full forward in the pits. Fitzgibbon is in the pits. Will we see Hoffman in the pits? No, we do not. We had now Hoffman has not pitted yet, guys. He is still out for ESM Racing. He completes lap 13 out of 19 to take the lead of the race. Don't forget, guys, same penalty applies. If you do not pit, you will get a warning. And if you finish in the top 10, your points will be removed. And everyone will be bumped into one. As we've got very closely with Hacking. I don't like that, Yoshi. I want my position back. Thank you very much. Ta very much. Thank you, darling. How can I check uh, my driver's health? I can't remember. Go onto your driver and you'll be able to see your health. Uh, Everyone's in. getting so panicky with curves. I know. Loads of people still got curves. Like Chloe's still got quite a bit of it. Oh yeah, Chloe's got loads. Using curves. Come on, Chloe. No, the Abe train's there. Go away. Oh, the Abe train. <laughs> Get that trend in Abe train. <laughs> <laughs> Go away. I'm in seven. I'm doing well for once. Don't ruin it now, please. Where's Alton Oh, he's miles away, never mind. Come on, Chloe, let's uh, catch up. That's it, I'm pushing hard now. No, I, I don't know, I'm, I think I put way too much fuel in. I've got 16 litres left. Let's go, girls. Let's go. We need some points. We need some points to buy you some more tyres. Right, Hoffman is in the pits. Hoffman is pitting from the lead, but he will jump down several positions here. As it's all going mental now with curves. Rob is right behind with DRS. Can he jump Scott into the first corner? Let's uh, see. Can we see this? Can Rob pass? Yes, he can. Rob is taking the league away from Rosberg as they're going to keep racing. Looks in agony to see if he can pass Scott. Scott has got loads of curves left. That is his saving grace right now. He has got loads of curves as Hot Palmer comes out the pits also down in 18th position. I need to push hacking like hell now because I am outside the points. You've got, I think, that's a full throttle um, leading it there. So Scott could lose second as well. Fish is right behind him now. And Abe's not too far away there, actually. Abe's sticking with them. In P5. He's actually quicker than Rosberg that time round. But he's killing his tyres a bit. But This is the fin now. The train from Fitzgibbon. That's for 7. The final point is with Becker. And you've got both of my cars and also Yossi trying to get a point. I think this is the first time Yossi's outside the points. I believe. As Becker has just gone on to ninth and passes Rodriguez. Come on, Abe. As Rob uses his remaining curves, Rob is slowly and starting to get away right now. He did a personal best last lap two seconds quicker. Wow. Obviously trying to push your tyres and maybe try and make up for lost ground towards the end, but... We serve C. Rodriguez like is in 10th yeah. place. That is a final point away. I need to push hacking really, really bad now. Alternate's... Oh, God, no, my fuel. Right. 2, 4, 6, 8, 12, 16, 15, 16. Oh, my God, that's going to be close. Come on, hack him. Get behind there. Oh, my Curry, God, that's going to be close. I might not have enough fuel. Really? Yeah. Whoa, 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 look at the fastest lap here, a 22-3 from O'Keefe. How? 22-3, he's on soft tyres, a brand new pair of rubber, but he's standing 30, but it looks like he's going to be overtaking over manly men here. Harrison's doing well on 28th, I've got to say, as uh, Rodriguez has got a little bit more curves than me, which is kind of annoying. Come on, use it up, Hakim. We need to get close here. We need to get close to these pills. I don't think I've got enough fuel left. Well, I don't care. Right, we go big or we go home. Come on. Oh, oh Liam's risking it now. Are I've you got a, 11 you're liters. You're in sixth place. I know, that's what I mean. It's the one I told you I had a bad feeling on Classic Jenkins it. 
At the very start of this race, as soon as I like that strategy, something bad's going to happen. I've got 10 litres of fuel. And what, 2, 4, 6, 8, That may make it. 10. No, it seven, won't. Six, You're seven, one lap down. Two. One lap short. Let's hope. Come on. I am so close to this point. I'm so close to this point right now. It's unbelievable. Alton and Zara as well, and also out of fuel nearly. He's just trying to catch a train of your drivers. I might just curse her all the way now and see how she goes. Wow, Thomas is going quick. 23-3, first sector, 27-5, middle sector. Uh, we're just waiting for Thomas to come across the line and see what kind of lap time he's doing. <laughs> um, on to the stretch we go. Uh, we see Alex. And we will see Thompson does a 22.75 of Alex again. Wow, we. I'm losing pace. Why am I losing pace? Well, Tim said back off now, I'll make it. I'm losing I pace. Don't, I'm losing if pace. If I back off and I lose, what, 7, 8, 9, I could lose my points. At the expense of finishing a race. 8 litres of fuel. That's going to be close. I don't think you're going to make it, though. Honestly, I don't no, think you're going to make it. No, I should make it. We've Surely. Got three laps left. Yeah, three laps, and I've got two, four, six, eight. Ooh. That should make <laughs> it. Yeah, push anyway. Push anyway. Come on. Because I'm losing time to Rob trying to make a decision. I I'm might as well I'm get out and time to you. You're gaining up on me. Your second car, What, alternate? Yeah. Yeah, she's pushing. I'm going to get that point, Tom. I'm not even the one for the point. You're looking at, uh, you have to get through, what, four cars? Uh, yeah, I see the, yeah. <laughs> That's the problem with me. I can't get anywhere. My tyres have shot. I'm just gone. 24-5. I'm doing decent times, though. Oh, look at that. Peterson, 23-2, but using Curtis or Yoshi. Really wants that points as uh, Dom's other car, M uh, Murusho, now starting to close up the gap behind here. But at the moment, Rob is leading the race, followed by Scott, followed by both of the keep racing guys. Then the inactive creativity um, still leading there. Where, and then you got Abe in sixth place. Then you got Rob, and then you got Dom, and then you got Full Throttle, and then you have got Rodriguez and the other inactive creativity. That'll be a great result from them. Have they actually scored any points in in inactive? I don't think I have actually hey, this season. I'm checking just now. One moment. Give us some commentary, Liam. <laughs> I, I'm too tense to do commentary. I mean, Abe's down to six litres of fuel. We've got two laps to go. I should theoretically make it. Fingers crossed. Inact Let's push for fifth. Inactivity has not scored points. Wow. So that would be a great result from him. All my curse is gone with Abe. It's now down in the hands of the gods. Also, have Keep Racing scored any points? Oh yeah, they have. They're third currently in the championships. So we've got two laps left, guys. Uh, to see Get him what, what will happen. I'm just losing time. I'm hoping you retire, but I need two people to retire in the front group. Alternate. I, I just want to overtake both Tom's cars. No. No, oh, that's, that's almost one. Uh, no. Well, you've got Dom behind us, so we've got to worry yeah, about I that. Yeah, I know. I just noticed that. <laughs> Oh my god, he's going past you. Probably he's. Yeah, that was... Yeah, that's never going to happen. 29-1 for the leaders. My guys... Oh, I'm doing personal... Oh, Hacken's just done a personal best at 29-4. Okay. Dom's overtook Liam. But it's only... I don't care. It's not for points. It's fine. You can have that all he wants. Oh, I think Jen's about to run out of fuel. Where's Jan? Outside, 18th. Oh, come on, why couldn't it be Michael? <laughs> okay, I'm really hoping I've got enough fuel in our final lap. Final lap, oh, we God. go. Rob is leading the way, followed by Scott, followed by the, both of the Keep Racing teams, followed by inactive, Inactivity... Um, I can't even say that, Inactive Creative Motorsport, followed by Abe, then Rob, then Dom, then you got Full Throttle, and then you got Battle for ninth place here. Oh, damn, I think Dom's just Chloe. Yes, she has. Oh, I yes, don't like that. Has. I could. I don't like that at all. Rob is close. Rob, up is... Rob There's battles everywhere. I don't know where to look. Scott is pitted. Scott has pitted in the second driver. 
is now down to 21st. Can Harrison manage to keep hold of 26th, I wonder? I, I am so. pushing 10! Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I gotta be carried away. <laughs> hold Rob, please. I'm doing my best! I'm trying! Oh! Rob is I'm... coming through. That's better, Abe! Look at that! What's Abe doing? Four tenths quicker. Oh, quickest set. Oh, wow. Half a second quicker than the car in front, Liam. But I think it's too little too late. And let's say I've run, run out of fuel. And let's say I've run out of fuel. But as we say that, Rob is coming through the final lap to come. Or final corner for to take the win. Back on form again. Rob takes the win. Can Scott hold out from these keep racing cars? Yes, he can. He will take second place from the bike. Keep racing in third and fourth. Inactive gets his first points of the season here at Monte Carlo. With Abe in sixth place. Rob is in uh, seventh <gasps> place. Becker and Abe. Rodriguez in ninth. And Fitzgibbon in tenth. Oh. And we're just waiting for Alex now because apparently we will see um, a, fail a failure in fuel soon. Harrison looks like he's got a hold of him in 26th place. He will be very happy in a very, very contested uh, Monaco Grand Prix here for the Jenkins Cup. Final few cars come across the line now. Rosberg down in 22nd. Not really good for Scott's other car there. Rodrock uh, coming across in 24th with Adam to win in 25th. Harrison comes across the line in 26th place. Really good job. Really, really good job. As Alex manages to finish with barely any fuel left. And then you've got LGA down in 29th and 30th. And then Overbanning Men coming down in 31st. And that is the race, guys. So very well done for everyone. Very, very well done. Very interesting to see some of the top guys there. Um, interesting to see the quick, like, time starting to die out a bit more at the end of that race there. And very well done to you, Liam, for getting safe place. Very well done. That was ridiculously tense. I can't deal with another race like that. Yeah, you can. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to have to. <laughs> this is the way the championship's gone. I mean, this has been phenomenal so far. Right. Okay. Race results, Liam. Will I take us for it? So, Rob back on form again, taking a win with Alvarez there for uh, Beast GP. 19 laps, started 8th and finished 1st. So we doubted him at the start. And he proved us wrong. Scott was leading for a bit. We thought he could pull off an underdog job. But he came second to a very good result nonetheless. Keep Racing did third and fourth. So a very consistent job by them as well. Started first and second. Ended third and fourth. Inactive, Inactive. creativity in P5. First points, good job. first points of the season for, uh, in fifth and ninth place. So well done to him. Very good job. And then you got Abe. I don't know how I did it on one lead to a few. But that's, I think that's my highest ever result, possibly. I'm not sure. It could be. But it is at Monaco, because I never finish at Monaco, so <laughs> well done there to Abe. Uh, BCP almost took me right at the end as well. He was around, I think, mean, two seconds away from me. Um, Becker as well in eighth, good job to him. Rodriguez in ninth in the other inactive creativity. Fitzgibbon rounds out your top ten in front of Yoshi. So Yoshi didn't score a point. That's the first time, I think, in a while that he failed to finish in the points this season. So that will I hurt think, in the middle yeah. of championship standings, especially with BCP getting a double points. So then Hacking finished 12th as well for Mad GP, so good result there for Tom. Mm. Mauricio 13th for Falcon, other uh, a Mad Strategy GP of Palmer. Alton and 15th could have been more, but she was just off pace. I think she was doing the crack coke again. 16th was Peterson, Hoffman 17th for East End in front of his teammate Palmer. Rodriguez in 19th in front of Overmanly Men and his compatriot Give Edgerton in 21st for Red Rock. Uh, Scott's other car in 21st, same story with nearly one doing really well and the other not so well. Garcia in 23rd for Adam to win, Red Rock in 24th, um, Conning in 25th for Adam to win, Harrison in 26th, Best result beating of the both season. of Alex's cars. Best result of the season as well for um, Harrison there. Alex could have had pace there, he did 22s for the fastest lap, 3 seconds faster than everyone else. So if he had a soft soft, who knew he could be winning this race today. Very well could be, but that's all kind of if, buts and maybes. Next race, so we'll have to see him back fighting. So you can see, so both Alex's cars, 27th, 28th. Both LJAs round out your top 30. And over Manly Men and Alacy round out the overall standings. So with that said, guys, the championship looks like this. I've overtaken people. Shush. 
Uh, <laughs> Yoshi with that foul points remain on 179 points. BGP manages to close the gap by 30 points with 149. Keep racing with that great little result there for third and fourth. Manages to get 93 points. Ros Rosberg, great result there for uh, second place there. Brings him up to 46 points. The battle will resume now. Me and Dom, 30 points apiece in tied for fifth place. Is there much sports? 27 points in 7th, Liam 23 points now in 8th place, Alex in 29th with 16, in creative activity gets 12 points from the first race, very nice and well done, Full Force also gets a point, so that's the first points of his season, but the remaining points so far, LJA, Adam to win, Red Rock Racing, Over Manly Men and Harrison Racing, all left to score a point and it only takes two two of those teams get to get a single point to make to guarantee the three bottom teams to try and get more points so that will be very interesting as the season goes ahead round seven next week thursday the 30th of june will be the turkish igp but we need to start copying odd apparently i believe so as I just copied someone's underbody. I am gonna copy. Oh, I can attempt the claim now. I forgot that. I don't know who to cop who who to who to copy. Oh, I'm down to five hundred thousand. We're gonna copy. Uh, actually, Yoshi didn't redo really that well. I want I want for a Rob actually. As well as I'm doing, I am on five hundred fourteen thousand pounds total. Five hundred fourteen thousand. Yeah. What is it with my team and debt? Seriously. Don't know. I just can never get money. I've got 78 million, so that ain't that bad. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's just bragging. 17! 78. Million? Yeah. How? Saving, my friend. Saving. I'm on 500 grand! I can't even afford a driver for next season! <laughs> um, Chaz, what happens if more than three teams are tied at, on zero points at the end of the season? I thought about this, Liam, and I'm going to put this out there. Would the, the name generator be the best bet? I just had that thought when you mentioned it. I thought, I wonder if we'll say the name generator. I think that would be, be a tense way of doing it, but there's no other real way of doing it, is there? Not really. Unless transfer my showdown. <laughs> no. Unless we take it from the best results like they do in real Formula 1. Yeah. So the highest position. I suppose so. Or um, just do whoever finished highest in the last race. That would No, that would have been unfair though. I feel. I think, really? I think name generator would be better. Or you could be... Do like our best average finish. That would take a lot of work and working out. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I don't mind doing averages and that, but that will take a long, long time. Um, but yeah, we'll think about that when it comes, Chaz. Uh, if it does, then we will have to think of something. Um, but yeah, that is the race done for today then, guys. Uh, I would say anyone want to talk about any Formula 1, but... Uh, those people are saying best results would be fairer, so I will do it by best results, um, like in real Formula 1, so we will see about that. So that's going to take me quite a while to figure that one out, um, but anyway, let's, we'll, we'll see. But, have you got anything else to say, Liam, today, apart from that pretty great racing, very, very close racing as well, that, that may I add? I think I'm too exhausted, <laughs> that was honestly brilliant, I mean... These streams just keep getting more competitive every time, and I've never seen a Monaco Grand Prix like that before. So, mm. again, just massive thanks to everyone for coming in and watching, but this has been amazing. Definitely, definitely. Um, no, I would talk about the Formula 1, but I haven't seen it, so I am probably going to watch it now and have some dinner. At work again tomorrow, and I have got my truck race at day... No, not the truck race tomorrow. That's on Monday. I've got the Formula 1 on tomorrow at 7 o'clock, apparently the race starts tomorrow, so that should be good fun, I think everyone will be watching that, and then, Liam, have you got your super glue ready for I've your I've got wheel? my super glue, and I tried to do it, but I realised that super gluing on super glue doesn't work. 
Because ah. there's, I've put so much super glue on the screws already that it's just a coat of super glue. So super gluing on top of super glue just creates more super glue. Ah, so what you gotta do? Mm, I don't know. I've got to probably get a hammer out or something. I don't know what that's gonna do. It just makes me feel creative. <laughs> uh, Chaz, what about Lammy GP not being? I will be sending him a message uh, after the stream goes down. If he does it again next week, then he will be out of that league. Um, harsh as it may be, but that is the rule. One of his drivers did pit, the other one didn't. So, you know, uh, I will have to send him a message about it. But apart from that, guys, I'm going to edit there. Um, it's getting slightly warm there in my room, so... But I hope you have enjoyed the stream, guys. We hit a peak of 25 viewers, so I thank you all for that, guys. And again, about average of 25 minutes uh, for, uh, for the average viewer. So again, thank you so much. It means so much to me and to Liam for, you know, giving you these streams and having so much entertainment. I don't think we can beat the entertainment value of yesterday's stream. And I can't believe nearly 100 people have watched that after the stream has finished. Wow. <laughs> I know, that's just crazy that that actually did happen. Um, but yeah, so I'm going, yeah, it's about 90 people. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm going to end it there, then, guys. Uh, I thank you for watching, and we shall see what will happen for the round seven of the Turkish IGP next weekend. So for me and Liam, thank you for watching, guys. This has been F Racing Mad at Home and Racing. I'll see you later, guys, and take care now. <laughs>